Welcome back. In this lesson, we are going to talk about the different options that you will have for a specific record. On the top left, you will see the picture of this person or the record. If you want to add a picture, you will click here on the picture and then you will upload a file. That will be a picture. You will have here the first name and last name of the person or the record name. And you can click here to add different tags. So let's say this is a great lead and I will just click and edit here. And you can have obviously multiple if you want. You can send an email from here. And in some cases, let me just remove that. In some cases, you would like to send an email. You click here and it's not working. In most cases, the problem will be it's or that your email is not integrated. And that's what we did in the second lesson. Or the email is not existing or the email is bouncing. But there is a problem with the email or your email or their email. And this is why it will block. You can also convert the lead into an opportunity. We'll talk about it in the future, what it means and when you convert. You can edit the entire page by clicking here. You can basically edit all the fields on this page. Here you will have different buttons and we'll talk about them in the future. Each button will have some functionality. We're going to talk it about it later. You will have here also a bunch of things that you can do. You can clone this record. Basically, you can clone this lead and then you will have one more lead in the system. A reason to clone will be that let's say you have two people from the same company. All the details will be identical. The only thing that is changing is the name of the person and the email. But the phone number of the company, everything is the same. Or you will have husband and wife. And then all the details are the same. But what's changing is really the phone number and the first names. So you will probably want to clone and save some time. You can share this record with other users from your company. You can delete this record. You can share it with ZooClick, which what I showed you in the previous lesson or two lessons before on the bottom. You can print preview and the print preview can be done from email templates, mail merge, and we'll talk about all those later on. You can find and merge duplicates the same way that I show you to do the duplicate in the previous lesson. You can also click here and then it will show you all the people, for example, with the same email or same first name or first last name. Okay, and let's continue. You can also uh, do a mail merge. We'll talk about it in the future lessons. You can also enrich data. So let's say that you are working out now on a lead and you want to receive more information about him. You will click on enrich data. And in my case, you can see that Zia didn't find anything because obviously it's a fake lead. But if you're working on a real person and you click on enrich data, it will provide you the address of the person, the name of the company, revenue, lots of cool stuff that you can make use of it. It's very, very good. You can run macros, which we'll talk about it later on. You can customize the business card and the business card will be what you see at the top. So those area, you can see that I have the lead owner, email, phone, mobile lead status, and that's exactly what you see here. If you want, you can remove some fields. You can add them here and then this business card will be changed. You can organize the lead details. You can add related list to the left side. You can review history, create buttons and so on. I don't think that you need to touch the ones on the bottom. It's uh, way too advanced. Keep it like that. If you want to add buttons to the top, contact a Zoho developer and they can help you. As an example here, for example, we have the open ABR card. If we click on it, it will load all the details of a specific lead in one place. So you can see all the tickets related to him, money, or EOs, anything in one place. That will be a button functionality. Okay, so if you want, a developer can do those buttons for you. You can pull information from third party websites, 
can update things, can copy, whatever you want. Those buttons are awesome, can have lots of rich functionality. On the left side, you will have what we call the related list. The related list will be things that are related to the record. As an example, here you can see six notes that are related to this lead. Here you can see all the status history of this lead. You can see related emails for this lead. So basically it's everything that is related to this lead. Everything that you see in the related list appears under the fields of this page. So you will have here all the fields, 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 and done. Here, those related lists are starting to take place, and you can see them here. Now, if you want to change them, to change those lists, you can click here on this small icon, and then you can move them around. Let's say I want the open activities to be under the notes and the closed activities under the notes. I will click on save and then it will rearrange the system. Okay, so this is the, the left side. Those will be those navigations. The way that you have a record is that you will have the overview the overview will have all the details, but if you will go to the timeline, it will show you what happened with the record in a very, very detailed view. So you can see who made the change. So here you can see that email was updated from nothing to Leo Isaac by Jim Bain and the date and the time. So you know exactly what happened. So if you have some kind of a mess with a record, you can see exactly who did it and it's very valuable. And this information here stays for around a year or so, something like that. So if it's important for you, you can talk to a, a developer that will keep this list forever. Basically, will create another module in the system and save all this information. And that's something that is available. It's a, it will take some time, it's not an easy job, but it's doable. Let's go back to the overview. You can see here that you have uh, different features. We'll talk about them later. This is a blueprint. This is the journey and so on. But right now we're not going to talk about any of that. You will have here the uh, business card, that, which we talked about it in a few minutes ago. And you have here the Zia best time to call. So based on the lead, the system will suggest when is the best time to call or email him. And whenever you get information here, usually it works pretty well. So Zia using artificial intelligence will be able to pinpoint when is the best time to connect so you can actually get a response. It's very good. Here you will have different fields and those fields are divided by sections. So you will have a section and fields section and fields, section and fields, okay? Uh, in a few lessons, I will also show you how to add fields, how to remove fields, how to edit sections and so on. On the left side, you have links. So let's say that I have my website, okay? I will copy the link. Sometimes people will always need to refer people to the website. So in that case, I can click on add link I will write here website and I will leave you the URL. And now this website is here. So when I'm talking to people and they say, okay, so uh, uh, do you offer any type of support? I will click here on the website. I will scroll down and I'll say, ah, oh, yeah, yeah, we have uh, the silver, the gold, the diamond, and uh, it works based on, based on ABC. And I can talk to them about it. And that is also a useful way to have those links. And you can have multiple links here. That works. You can also have links on the top if you want. Same way that I have it on the left bottom, I can have them also on, on the top and they can send me to different websites. That's also doable. We'll touch it uh, on that later on in the process. That's it. 
I will see you in the next lesson and we'll dive to more cool things about Zoho. Thank you for watching the lesson. If you'd like to know more about us, we are Amazing Business Results. We are a Zoho Premium Partner and we offer a few services. One service will be Custom Zoho Development. That means that you're coming with your own business problems and we'll find the right Zoho solutions for your needs. We also develop extensions. Those extensions will be applications that we created that are plug and play to your Zoho system. And each one of, of those extensions will solve a specific business problems for units. We are also a Ring Central reseller, which means we can sell you the Ring Central system, which is a phone and text message system. And because you're buying it from us, we'll give you the license to use our extension for free for one year. Mm -hmm.